know what I mean? At the end of the, <coughs> the, end of the day, I'm a, um, <coughs> I'm a household name, and I'm a, I'm a fan, I'm a, I'm a fan favorite. I'm a family favorite. Um, yeah. A lot of people consider me their motivation. A lot of people consider me um, their spirit animal. A lot of people consider me as um, an idol, an idol to them, or someone that they find inspiration and motivation from. So with that being said, when my plat- <coughs> my platform is taken away from me. You still have all these people that are searching for this information, they're searching for this enlightenment, or they're searching for this entertainment and joy. And, you know, it's a lot of different artists and a lot of different people on, on the landscape, but it's only one South Walker. Yeah, yeah. And you're talking about that, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're one of the trailblazers of like the new generation as far as like music goes. Like, how do you feel about you and what you've been doing as far as like bringing all like the Texas music culture together? You've been seeing the dialect, San Antonio, you've been going. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, um, for number one, Texas is very important to me, and not just Houston itself, but just the entire state of Texas. I feel like mm-hmm. we've been deprived, and we've been, you know, uh, we've been dishonored of all the things that we created, and all the innovation, and all the leverage that we've given different cities and states to expand their musical horizon and expand their platform and have have more ingredients to use as musicians or as entertainers because Houston is a place that's so rich in culture and so rich in activity that people come here and drawn by the energy that's here that doesn't exist anywhere else and then they take that energy and rebottle it up and try to make it in their city or rap about it from their perspective and not bring along the people or the city that gave them that perspective or gave them that that motivation or that initiative. And outside of that, uh, yeah. my purpose and point with me just being, been, I've been in the game for, I think, like eight years, maybe eight, nine years in the rap game, mm-hmm. independently and staying relevant. I always, I possibly have, if I don't, I, I'm not trying to toot my own horn, but yeah. I probably have the biggest independent record label in America in the industry right now. Mm. If, if the only other competitor that I have that's doing the same things or better that what TSF is doing independently of this generation is possibly a PRE. You know what I'm saying? RP Young Dog, shout out to Young Dog Keep like send my condolences to everybody in their family, but yeah. PRE and TSF, like, you know, they're the two biggest and largest with the most successful acts and getting the most streams and having pl- plaques of so- platinum plaques and gold plaques. I would have to say TSF at this current moment is the biggest independent record label in the industry. We've probably been there for a little while now.